Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Taurus. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of December 28th through January 3rd. Keep in mind, the timing is still fluid, and not every reading is for you, okay? This reading may or may not be for you, okay? So, let's just see what comes up. Happy New Year. I know it's been a long wait. It's been a long wait. You guys have been waiting for this. It's finally your turn. Let's get started. What do we have for Taurus? What do we have for Taurus? For the week ahead. Ah, judgment. So judgment is a card of awakening, okay? Judgment is a card of karma, truth, truths being revealed, uh, resurrection, absolution. This is the end of things, the end of a trial, a final decision being made. So you, there is a final decision being made this week. Truths are being revealed. Responsibility is being assigned. This is a card of being held accountable. Okay, and this is a card of conscious awakening, getting some sort of epiphany. Okay, so there is some sort of epiphany here that awakes you up in some way. There is some sort of decision that is being made as well. It is going to, that's a life changing decision, judgment is. This is the end of something. You think about judgment day, it's when, you know, you reach the end, you reach the end of a life. Right? You eat the, if you think about Judgment Day, actual Judgment Day, you've reached the end and you are given a chance. You are, somebody may be giving you a chance. Okay? A chance to live a new life. Something like that. So what do we, what do we have for Taurus? That can also be a card of forgiveness, resurrection, absolution, transcendence. What do we have for Taurus? I feel like there's something going in your favor with it being in the upright position. There it is. And we got four cards. Four. Four, 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 four. So, I don't know why I said that, but fours are about all is well. There's universal protection. There's angels around. Four is an angel number. So, there's angels around. There's protection. Something is coming to fruition. This may have to do with a foundation because fours are also about foundations. There are invisible forces here. Now, this could be somebody from the past. Could be a past life. Could be somebody that has passed away that is guiding you. Okay, there is some sort of uh, something about the past here or somebody that has passed away. You meet there could be an angel. There's some sort of guidance. Okay, hat. Ooh, you will be playing a different role. You see, I cut my finger. <laughs> Let me just wipe that off a little bit. It's interesting because yesterday I did a daily about getting cut and I cut my finger about an hour ago. Um, I did the daily yesterday, so it just came out of nowhere. Um, you will be playing a different ro role. Okay, you're going to be playing a different role. Horseshoe. Good luck. This is good luck. October is very prominent. You could be dealing with somebody that is born in October. Or you may have done something in October. Or October of next year is, is, is playing a part. But October, maybe you've made a life-changing decision in October. Okay, October is very prominent. You could also be dealing with a Libra or a Scorpio. Bat. Uh -huh. Take care. Enemies are working against you. Well, that's a give it now, isn't it? Story of my life. I don't know about yours. But anyhow, uh, you will be playing a different role. You definitely could be dealing with a Scorpio. Um, good luck is on your side. October is prominent. Somehow, it would have to do with the Scorpio that you're dealing with. Anyhow, it may not be, though. Anyhow, um, however, think back to October. What were you doing in October? Now, you think about 
judgment is also like the phoenix rising from the ashes. So if you have been in a situation that has been, uh, I don't know, killing you or hurting you or causing you to to stay um, down, causing you a lot of strife or causing you to have doubts or whatever, things are about to get better by the looks of things. You're going to be playing a different role in some way. Rising from the ashes, whatever that means. I had to say it, so good luck is on your side. There is somebody that is working against you, no doubt. Absolutely. It's a pest. The chariot reversed. So there's there could be a delay. There could be a delay. Could be dealing with a cancer. Doesn't have to be, but the chariot reversed. That is a need to master your emotions. This could be the person that is working against you. Somebody could be angry. They could be angry about your decision. <laughs> That's probably going to be the case. So, yeah, I feel like somebody is going to be angry about your decision. That's anger. <laughs> the chariot reversed. I mean, th th it could even be you. I mean, this this is somebody that is lacking control, lacking dis discipline. This is emotions all over the place. Um lack of direction, feeling scattered, uh, trying to stop something from happening. That could be a stop. It could be a stop. Um, oh, jeez. The tower. So the tower is a disaster. This is a disaster ahead. And there's, there's, so there, there, there could be some sort of disaster ahead. I don't know if there, there could be, this could be a car accident. I mean, I hope it's not a car accident, but I'm, I mean, I have to be honest. I have to be, I have to be authentic. But when you, it could be. This is a vehicle and this is an accident. So let's pray to God that that does not happen. Anyhow, um, the tower is a major upheaval. It's a major uh, awake. It's a rude awakening. Somebody's going to get a rude awakening. get prepared get, I mean and you can't prepare for it you can't but this is something that you don't see coming you don't see it coming this is a shock okay a shock to your system so it's a shocking change whatever it is the devil reversed my god we have all majors here so the universe, the universe is driving a change. You are not in control. Okay, the universe is in control. Much as you want to be in control and I want to be in control, I'm not in control and neither are you. I hate to say it. It's hard for it to, to even come out of my mouth. But this is not in your control. The universe is in control. The universe is driving a change. It is probably going to make you angry. Maybe angry. Maybe there could be an emotional outburst ahead. There could be a disaster ahead making me sick anyhow the devil reversed that is uh, a need to break free there's probably some addiction here there could be an addiction now this could be somebody that you're dealing with it doesn't have to be you somebody somebody in this situation is codependent they are codependent on something and they cannot control it it's out of control there's a need for discipline there is a need for uh, determination to break free from this this is some sort of bond or connection or attachment that needs to go and somebody isn't finding the uh, mental strength or the discipline or the willpower to let it go so the universe is like i'm gonna freaking slap you upside the head and make you let it go you know i'm gonna i'm gonna kick this into high gear okay because we have some karma here judgment is a card of karma Okay, it's time for something to end. That is that is the end of things. Like I said, some it's time for something to stop. Okay, something needs to end. Okay, and this is whatever you've been bound to that is unhealthy, because the devil is about an unhealthy, well, uh, connection. Okay, 
so somebody is is unable to control themselves. I you know there could be um, an uproar. Somebody could uh, do something crazy because of that devil. I mean it's very crazy life-changing energy put it that way somebody is breaking free from an unhealthy situation all of a sudden this is a very sudden it's a very sudden change okay that stops you it stops you it may stop you in your tracks you know whatever whatever it is it um, may it could be an emotional outburst ahead somebody can't manage their feelings there, there could be I don't even know this for some of you I mean the tower can be an explosion an internal disruption an accident um, there's a foundation that is being uprooted okay this foundation is being uprooted there could be a, some sort of uh, shocking change that is happening um, you could be dealing with a Capricorn you could be dealing with a Cancer you could be dealing with a Scorpio Oh, so these three cards, disaster, disaster, disaster. And I hate to give that message considering I'm a Taurus. Okay. So this is suffering. You must free yourself. There is some sort of freedom that is coming with the devil reversed. The universe is breaking you free from something. Okay, you, you, you may, because this is the universe, tower is the universe. The universe is breaking you free from something that is unhealthy. Okay, but it's going to be emotional. This is emotional breakdown, or, you know, you may have an emotional breakdown, or somebody around you might. Anyhow, this is a fated event. This is an uprooting of some sort. Okay, um, get, you can't prepare for it. You aren't going to be prepared for it because it comes out of nowhere. It does come out of nowhere. So this is freedom from an unhealthy situation. There's going to be some sort of resolution. Okay, this is something is coming to an end. There's no doubt about it. Um, it may make you sick to your stomach because at this point I do feel sick to my stomach. It, it just like that. So I don't know what this is. Um, when you get the devil reversed, there could be some sort of addiction. Somebody is in a deep, dark place. They can't control their emotions, and they could do something crazy. Now, I don't know who this person is, but uh, I may know who this person is, and you probably do too. So, anyhow, um, Emperor, definitely, this is Mars energy. It is Mars and Uranus. Damn it! So this is somebody trying to stop somebody or somebody that is out of control that wants control. Somebody wants control. This is all about power and control. Could have something to do with a father or a very masculine energy. This is somebody who wants control. And they may cause an uproar. <laughs> They may cause an uproar. They may explode. Somebody makes, there could be an explosion. There could be an accident. There could be, you know, a belt of anger. I mean, I'm just being completely honest with you. This is somebody who wants to be in control. And uh, they're unhealthy. There's unhealthy behavior here with that devil reversed. And I feel like this person cannot master their emotions. And... Hmm. Emperor is somebody that is using their head, not their heart. You know, very rigid, very distant. Um, has a tough exterior that is looking to fight. Somebody wants to fight. Very obsessed. Obsessed with holding on. Somebody is obsessed with holding it. This is an obsession. Four of Pentacles reverse. Somebody is obsessed with holding on. They need to let go. They need to let go of a false sense of security, but they haven't found their ability to do so. They haven't found their mental strength or their determination or their self-discipline to let go of this false sense of security. It's a false foundation. It's it's not stable. They're not stable. It's not stable. It's not secure. It's not built on solid ground. And, and if somebody's holding on to something that isn't solid when it's really time to go, it's like they're trying to, to force. And this is force. And I feel like now the universe is taking control. The universe is taking control and they are forcing somebody to break free from a toxic situation they're making the decision you can't make the decision 
or the other person, somebody can't make a fucking decision. So the decision is being made by the universe to force a life change. And this is a major life change. We got five majors here. You will be letting go of something that is not healthy for you. You are not in control. And it does make me sick. Knight of Swords. Now this is somebody rushing in a hurry. They're on a mission. We have somebody that is on a mission and they probably are angry. This is getting out quick. Making a getting getaway. Somebody that is very single-minded that is doing something very, very fast. Taking swift action. Putting plans into action. Getting out. Making a getaway. So, somebody's trying to get away. They're trying to get away. You could be dealing with somebody who is a fighter. This person, because there's, there's, and there could be even uh, judge or or army or military or um, police or something getting involved. I mean, I hope that's not the case, but somebody in a position of authority may end up getting involved because of something extreme. This is extreme. I mean, the, the tower is extreme energy and a, 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 a serious upheaval. Okay, you're going to be dealing with some upheaval. Okay, and this is a control issue. It's a power and control issue. There could be some legal situations that are coming into play this week. Um, we have a very unhealthy individual that is codependent on another and it's not meant to be. And the universe is saying, no, no, no. We, they are. They're saying, no, 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 no. You have to let this go. And you're refusing to let it go. It's not meant to be. Anyhow. So I feel like there's going to be a battle. There's going to be a fight. There's going to be a dispute that causes chaos. Okay. Dealing with a Capricorn, an Aries, a Scorpio, um, Taurus. You're a Taurus. Um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You may be feeling that, I don't know if there's some sort of attack, you know, feeling like you're being attacked. Great strength. Yeah, there's going to be some sort of battle. We have somebody here that knee is going to, it feels like wounded. Somebody may get hurt, you know, or, they're, 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 or they may say that they're wounded, say that they're hurt. You know, I feel I feel like we need to really be careful this week. Oh my god. Great strength. We have somebody here that it feels like they could get hurt. I hate to say that. Anyhow, um October something started in October. And I feel like it's it's coming to a head this week. Things are going to blow up this week. It's coming to an end this week. This is about taking charge. Somebody is going to be, the universe is taking charge. That's what's going on. And they're going to be moving somebody, okay? The Knight of Swords is moving in a new direction. But I feel like there's, you know, this this this, this Nine of Wands is a wounded warrior, somebody that is going to be facing some challenges. I'm not sure if somebody could end up in jail. And I hate to say that. It, I hope that doesn't If it happens, there will be retribution. Because I feel like there will be, okay? So um, there will be a price to pay for that, I just got to say. Anyhow, um, great strength. Somebody is, is going to feel like they're going to be charged. They're going to be charged with something. I don't know if it's abuse. The 
this is definitely going to be a week of great change. Okay? A decision is being made. Okay? This is a decision. This is a decision. It's time. It's time to break free from this unhealthy codependent situation. And if you're not going to do it, the universe is going to cause a major disturbance to make it happen. There could be somebody that is charging in. They are rushing. It could be the cops. I mean, I don't know. There could definitely be an argument or a fight. Anger. Somebody could get really, really angry. But I also feel like there's lies here. I feel like there's lies, and I and I I don't I don't know because there's falseness, there's falseness, and somebody not telling the truth. There's lies. I feel like there's somebody here that is going to tell a lie to get somebody in trouble. Karma never loses an address. Somebody may end up in court. Okay, there could be some court here. Okay, because this is judgment, and this is like a judge. Somebody could end up in court. They could also end up behind bars because I'm just saying, I, I feel it. Somebody could, could be dealing with Capricorn, Aries, um, or a person that owns, it could be, we could have a business owner here, somebody that is in a position of authority that is abusing their power, may have something to do with a vehicle. Driving really, really, really fast or moving really, really, really fast. Princess of Swords. Now, this is the Page of Swords. So, this is probably a message that you don't want to hear. Uh, somebody may be biting off more than they can chew, causing a conflict, sticking their nose in where they shouldn't. You may have an untrustworthy individual here that is saying something without thinking. They're getting another person in trouble. You may need to draw some boundaries. I think there's going to be an unexpected conflict this week. I do. Oh my God. You will be playing a different role. Take care. There's an enemy working against you. Which we are... Which we know but good luck <laughs> yeah good luck luck is on your side is that the case good luck with this enemy i mean is that what that is there is a false sense of security here that somebody needs to let go of but this person is too controlling to let go so the universe is going to put like a barrier and there is a barrier. They're going to put a barrier in the way. They are. They're going to they are. They're going to put a barrier in the way that is going to force somebody to break that barrier. There's going to be a break. There is going to be a break of some sort. Ooh. Shock. This is a shock. Somebody may also be opening up. Now I'm changing the story about story for a minute. Somebody may be opening up. This is somebody that has gotten a rude awakening. They have gotten a rude awakening and they have broken free. They have broken free. They've been wounded by another person and now they're going to be communicating. I mean, that could be the case as well. Somebody may have broken free from a toxic, unhealthy situation and now they're and they've been watching and waiting and they're wounded and they're hurt and here they come. I mean, here they come. Really, really, really fast. There's been some sort of delay. This person has been all over the place, but now they are taking charge. Somebody could be taking charge. You could be receiving some shocking news that absolutely shocks you. Now, we got thousands of people that watch this, so it could go. And this I could keep going all day and give you ten different stories. Either way, the judgment, there could be a reconciliation here. This is a chance. 
There's a chance for forgiveness. Somebody may be asking for forgiveness, but there will be some sort of judgment call that is being made this week. You are going to be playing a different role. You're going to be getting some news that maybe shocks you. Whatever the news is, it shocks you. I feel like there's a decision that is being made in your favor. Oh, yay. Knight of Wands reverse. Now, this could be a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. There's definitely a force here. There could be some violence. There could be. I got to be honest with you. There could be some violence. We may have somebody here that has a chip on their shoulder. They're out of control. They're moving very fast. And, you know, I, I you know, they be careful. If I was you, I'd stay home. And I got fucking appointments this week. And far away. Oh, my God. Anyhow, I might just want to stay home or not. Oh, God. Knight of Wands reversed. Um, slow down. Slow down. Somebody needs to slow down. There's reckless. There's recklessness here. Somebody moving way too fast. Okay? Moving very, very fast. A need to slow down. Oh, man. angry as well so I think we have somebody here that is going to have in some sort of angry outburst and I feel like it's going to cause chaos for some of you um, we may have somebody that is showing off they're showing off and you know or speeding or something and you know showing off or speeding can cause an accident so I'm, I'm not sure what is going on but I feel like uh, your life is about to change in a very big way and you don't even see it coming. Where are we at? One more card. One more card. <laughs> Ten of Pentacles. That's a good one. So that's, that's a success. Okay, there's some sort of success that is coming. This is long-term financial success, new home, um, permanence, changing, a change of residence, perhaps, family support, building a new foundation. Whatever is happening, I think you are going to be okay. You may be dealing with somebody that is out of control. Somebody's foundation is going to be shaken. It may have to do with your home, where you live. There's going to be an uprooting. Okay, that's an uprooting. It is. Good luck. 